So Paul. Yeah. Um, I I admit. Uh huh. Bring it. I was initially very upset about this next segment when it was suggested. You were certainly, I think it's fair to say, skeptical. Yes. In so far as your eyes rolled up and into the my interior eyes? of your head. Yes, and then they rolled out of my ears and uh, onto the Lido deck where I chased them around for an hour. To be fair, to be fair to you, Ms. Jean Grey, uh -huh. it's a stupid fucking idea. But they're stupid, and then there's the kind of stupid that you're like, Stupid like a fox. As the well-known saying goes, stupid like a fox. And uh, it, it was proven to me that it was amazing. Well, I, I will freely admit, this next segment was designed specifically and solely to anger my younger daughter. <laughs> she was at the first show. I believe she was sufficiently angry. <laughs> I had the bonus of really making Gene upset with the entire concept before it happened. But you don't know what you're in for, ladies and gentlemen, so we're going to tell you. This is the second of two Joko Cruise 2019 Dabbing Competition. <laughs> Right? That's the exact yes. right reaction yes. to that concept. What? <laughs> no. Ooh. Ah. So you think. Yeah. Yeah, and then I realized I was also uh, emotionally connected to it because immediately when you announced the contest, my husband was directly next to me. He was like, I'm in. <laughs> like, you were in what the fuck? And your, his arm was already up. <laughs> Um, so those of you who do not have preteens in your house, or have not looked at internet memes from two to four years ago... It's pronounced meme. Meme. Who have not looked at internet meme. Uh, dabbing is a thing that uh, is really lame when it started and is now several years out of date. Perfect for Joko Cruz. It's the following move usually done on internet videos by preteen children, and it is this. And I would like to add strong dab by Paul. That's the standard dab, but we are bringing out two people to take things to the next level. Will you please welcome our competitors for the red team tabbing competition, Quali Christopher and Marion Ovenet Koa. What is your name? Hi, my name's Lee. Thank you for knowing where to put the mic. <laughs> I gotta admit it's a weird cognitive dissonance thing. You are uncomfortably close to my face. <laughs> and, uh, and your name is? Okay, that's been established now. Not officially part of the rules, but unfortunately we've checked the rule book, there is nothing specifically against it. So it's up to you. Uh, we're gonna do, are we gonna do three rounds? And uh, uh, we split the coin backstage. Wh who, which of you won the coin toss? Uh, and we'll be going first. Uh, he did because I can't catch things. <laughs> Very good reasoning. So Lee, you'll be going first? Oh, okay, Quelly, are we going first? Do you have any uh, setup you need to give this deck? <clears throat> I would like um, one of these two fine judges to give me a good 
Feel free to join in. This is what I call the stateroom bag drop off bag. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Elvis has left the building. Oh no, here we go, okay. We, again, we checked the rule book. This is entirely legal. <laughs> the state room luggage drop off tab. It's a classic from 2012. Look how it started. <laughs> from Helsinki, here yeah. in the quarterfinals. Yeah, yeah. All right, yeah. round two. What are you bringing us? Uh, I'm doing a double rod. Um, so I do like my rods nice and firm. <laughs> and for this one, I'm using an extended rod metaphor. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for those pity laughs. <laughs> um, and, and a wind-up. That's all. Okay. I'm, I'm staying classic, not gimmicks. <laughs> are just as important as the show voting. Very, very true. Very true. All right, we are the third and final round. Yes. Quale, what you bringing? I would like to bring up, also, thank you to one of my uh, dab assistants, Dana. But I would like to bring up two more dab assistants. The leader of the McElroy clan, Clint McElroy. And scientist, artist, and this is what I call the Bionic Woman Dab. <laughs> Do you need sound effects to go with yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, he does. Okay. Let me get a little. <laughs> you got this gene or shall no. I? <laughs> They're called also the Vitruvian dab. Yes. <laughs> All right, Lee. Final dab, final round. Yeah, I, 
I do have to compliment the artistry on that one. That was that was very nice. That was that was that one was nice. <laughs> Let it go. Let it go. against it. We do have a new Olympic and world record. I don't know that we sh can or even should choose between these two incredible winners. I say everybody wins. Give it up for us. It's all about the love. Thank you to our wonderful drivers. That was some shit. Did we do this? Who can say? Oh, they are. <laughs> Again, I mostly blame the haunted floor. <laughs> Uh, well, we certainly went on an adventure in the food court there. <laughs> that is like, I, I want that to be your young adult novel series. Jean Grey and her adventures in the food court. Book one, one Chick-fil-A? It's also a choose your own adventure. <laughs> All the adventures just end. Gosh. Dear Lord me. Okay, right. uh, let's segue right on to let's our segue. next segment so you can wipe all of that away from the memory banks. Because <laughs> you're the one that's going to have to go into the state room with him tonight and decompress. And, and I kind of wanted the extra hands, but then I go. <laughs> Who believe in fairies? <laughs> Please, I need that. No. 